gostoso.
Your voice, your hands everywhere you are. The presence of God is heavy here. The power of God is heavy here. The anointing of God is heavy here. Something is about to drop. Something is about to drop. Oh, we know. Can you be upstanding everywhere you are? Hands lifted. Lift it high up. Father, thank you for your presence here. Close your eyes. The Bible said in that day, the body shall be lifted from off your shoulder. And the yoke from off your neck and the yoke shall be destroyed. Because of the anointing. He said the fire devoured before them. And behind them a flame bonnet. The land before them is like the garden of Eden. That's right. And behind them a desert wilderness here. And nothing shall escape them. Something is about to drop. There is a healing right here. There is a deliverance right here. There is an impartation right here. There is a breakthrough right here. There is a release right here. You are going to lift up your hands. And when I say, in the name of Jesus. Jesus. One, two, three. You will place your hand on your head and scream, I receive. There is a healing right here. There is a deliverance right here. There is a liberation right here. There is a breakthrough right here. Man of Galaya. Ancestral curses are about to be broken. Generational curses are about to be broken. Witchcraft powers are about to be broken. Occultic powers are about to be broken. Evil foundations are about to be reversed. In the name that is above every name. Father, let it happen. Let it happen. The arrow of premature death is about to be retrieved and refired back to hell. Stagnation maritally is about to be broken. The spirit of barrenness is about to be broken. Lift your hands high. When I say the name of Jesus, one, two, three, you place your hand on yourself and scream, I receive. And you receive your healing. You receive your deliverance. You receive your breakthrough. You receive your liberty. You receive your impartation. Father, let it flow. Let it flow. Right now, let it fire fall. Are you ready? In the name of Jesus, one, two, and three. Receive, receive, receive. Receive it, receive it, receive. Receive liberty. Receive liberty. Receive liberty. Receive your release. Receive your release. Help her, right? Help her. Help her. Receive your release. Receive your release. Receive your release. Mana Galayano, Sadi. Leperete Sidana. Lite Sefredinado. Leperena Managada de Galalo. Rete Sefredina Galala. Ita Sefredino La Pranido. La Pranido Seperedigala. Ele Perete Sita Frena de Galolo. Rete Perita Zina de Galala Horania. Receive it, receive it, receive it. Receive it, receive it, receive it. Receive the touch of his power. Father, we give you the praise and give you the honor. Give you the adoration. Blessed be your name. Honor to your name. Worship to your name. Thank you, Master. Lift your hands and receive it a second time. Father, let it be. Let it be. Let the yoke be broken. Let the chain be broken. That's right. At this time, satanic le 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 legislations are about to be over. Demonic litigations are about to come to an end. When I say in the name of Jesus, and you scream at one, two, three, and you scream, I receive your liberty is here, your deliverance is here, your freedom is here. Are you ready to receive? Father, let it be in the name of Jesus. One, two, and three. I receive. Receive. 
happen to you. Wave your hands and give him the praise. Give him the praise. Give him the honor. Give him the adoration. Give him the worship. Something just left you. Someone just had an encounter. A change of story happened to you. If you just experienced something just now, I would like you to run forward here and let's see what God did for you. Somebody's shoulder that is unable to lift because of paralysis or an accident or something. That shoulder is lifted right now. You are able to move that shoulder that you couldn't move before. I'd like you to run to the front here. And also, if you had an encounter, a deliverance, God pulled you out of a pit, pulled you out of a cage, pulled you out of something in your father's house, in your family, in your community. Quickly run to the front here. Shoulder that couldn't go up freely like this. Just now, the Lord has healed it. Move that shoulder, and if you can move it, run to the front here quickly. Give the Lord a big clap. Apart from any other person that had an encounter, a deliverance encounter, a healing encounter, a liberation encounter, give the Lord the praise. Give him the shout of victory. A bigger, bigger, bigger shout of victory. Thank you, Master. Thank you, Adonai. Thank you, Master. This kind God do. I never see your type. This kind God do. Blessed be your holy name. This kind God, oh, this kind God, oh, God, oh, God, oh. I never see your type, oh. This kind God, oh. Blessed be your holy name. This kind God, oh, this kind God, God, oh, God, oh. I never see your type, oh. Quickly find out what happened. This kind God, oh. Blessed be your name. This, this, this kind God, oh. I never see your type oh. This kind of love Can't you see your blessing coming? I see it coming Can't you see your blessing coming? Can't you see your fire coming? Can't you see your liberty coming? Take it now, I take it now, take it now Take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it Take it now Take it now Take it now, take it, 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 the Lord a praise. What's happening here? Please take your seat one minute if you can. A miracle just happened here now. So this man came here with a locked waist. His waist had been locked for the past two weeks, sir. He said he couldn't bend, couldn't do nothing. Right now as you made the declaration and we shouted I receive, the power of God came upon him. His waist became loosed. Now he can do what he couldn't do before. God just gave him a miracle. Do everything you couldn't do before. I announce, I prophesy to someone, everything that is locked in your life is unlocked right now. Power of the Holy Ghost. Everything that is unlocked, every marital door unlocked, every financial door unlocked, every, every, every door of the womb locked. I command them unlocked right now. Yes, sir. Our sister here just had an encounter. She told me that as we were worshiping and you were blowing the instrument, her eyes became open. She started seeing angels all over this place, giving gifts to people, not just that. She saw the power of God came upon her. You gave her a Bible and then fire started coming out of her mouth. 
It is truly light and fire. Hey! How many of you are receiving your own gift? Take it, 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 but there's something happened here. Yes. He said, whilst you were ministering, yes. you stood here and your hand strength forth where he was and touched him. And the moment your hand touched him, he just shouted, I receive it. And he saw himself changing to another level. From here, the hand reached yeah, there. Hand reached him that there. is the hand of Jehovah. Come up here. How many of you are receiving the touch of his hand here tonight? I announce to you right now the hand of Jehovah, the lengthy hand of the, those of you standing on the roadside right there and in all your houses where you are. I see the hand of Jehovah touching you and changing your story. Are you ready? Somebody shout power! Receive the touch of his hand. Receive that touch of his hand. In the name of Jesus. Brother Enoch here told me it's like somebody is sitting inside him. For very long time now, he finds out that somebody like an impersonating demon is always inside him. His life is confused, just rumbling in circles. He told me there is nothing working for him. Sometimes it feels like he hears voices and his mind is not coordinated. He said, as you made the declaration, something left him. He saw somebody left his body. That personality left, left him. him. Stand over here. Somebody place your hand and say, every stranger. Say it louder, every stranger around my life today is your expiry date. In the name of Jesus, on your marks, on your marks, get set, shout, get up, get up. Hey, 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 hey. Every stranger, every stranger, every stranger, every stranger. So, someone, a man that has a name that is like Enoch that starts with an E with a deaf ear on the right ear check your ear now and God is opening that ear right now you can't hear with one ear whether you were born with it or it came along the line the name starts with an E wherever you are you run forward quickly and confirm your hearing let him come let him come let him come let him come Somebody give the king the shadow praise, the shadow victory. For how long you couldn't hear with the ear? I started noticing it when I was in class five. In class five? Yes, please. From class five, you couldn't hear with which ear? The left ear. Since class five? So now. Till now. And even the right ear is, is deteriorating. The right ear is deteriorating. Close this ear right now. In Jesus' name. Jesus. It is done. Give the Lord a big clap and a louder shout of praise. A bigger clap and a louder shout of praise. I use this to announce to somebody in the name that is above every name. Jesus Christ, the resurrected Lord. Everything that is closed in your life. Every door closed in your life. Today, I declare that door is open. Daddy, our dear sister, our dear sister, for some time has not been feeling well. So came here while she were ministering, suddenly she started coughing. And then a vomit, a substance came out of her life right now here. And she believes that she's free forever. Lift your hands. What's your name? Father, in the name of Jesus. Somebody say, every stranger in my life, today is your end. Oh, you stranger, on your marks, get set, shall go. Go, go, go. Come and see. Done for me. Come and see what the Lord has done for me. 
come and see what the Lord has done for me. If it were to be man, I will really pay. Yes, what happened? Amazing, sir. As we were making those declarations, he felt the power of God come over him, and then he saw like his face on fire, a face like fire from his face, lifted up and left him. He had been plagued by his currently undergoing a very painful divorce and other situations and immediately that happened he received peace. Wow, lift up your hands. In the name of Jesus the Lord break that year. Jesus precious name. Amen. There are about 15 people with the ear that is not hearing one ear or two about 50 wherever you are just stand in front of the choir here if you are among that category of people that are not hearing with one ear or two ears that's right you just stand in front of the a line in front of that choir there father thank you we give you the praise and the honor place your hand on the ear that is not hearing just one line if, if you study, just attend to them one line Father, in the name of jesus I take authority. That's right. Just one straight line. I take authority over the deaf devil of deafness. Your tenure expired. That straight line. Straight line there. Don't, don't, don't form a second line. There is already a straight line there. Don't disrupt the line. There is already a first line right there. You are disrupting that line. Those people are already on the line. Place your hand on, in, in, in the ear that is not hearing. I take authority over this deaf devil of deafness. Your tenure expired. Now, this is a sign and a wonder to somebody. As the Lord opens the ears that are not hearing, he is going to open your financial doors, your career doors, your destiny doors, your marital doors. He's going to open doors that are closed. Father, right now, I take authority over the deaf devil of deafness. Your tenure expired in this years right now. You are living at the count of three in the name of Jesus. One, two, three, somebody shout go! 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 go. Right now, I command the ear open. A plane. Help her, help the woman on the line there. In Jesus' name. It's done. That's right. That's right. You can remove the hand from the ear now. Excellent. If it is one ear, the good one. Close the good ear. Close the good ear. And if it is two ears, open both. Leave both open. But if it's one ear, close the good ear. If it is two ears, leave both open. And say after me, Jesus. Say amen. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Amen. Every of you who can hear and repeat what I'm saying, quickly run up to the altar here. Let them come through. As many of you as were able to hear what I said with your hands closed, closing. Are you just looking like that? Hey. Up, 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 up here, up, up here. As many of you as could hear what I said with your hands closing the good ear. Are you just standing and looking like that? Clap your hands, all ye people. Shout to the Lord. One line, one line, one line. Oh, it's more than one line. We can't do one line. All right. All right, one line. Just, just, yes. Tell me about this while they come up. Okay. Sir, amazing. This man just got won a metal warrior armor. He said like Iron Man. That's who are making the declarations. The armor came on him with a sword in his hand. He's ready to destroy any devil. Hey! He's so confused. He's so amazed. He's Listen, really God is putting weapons in your hand. And you are going to take the weapons to Volta region and take it to Kofiridwa and take it to Bolga and take it to Tamale and take it to Kumasi. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you call the name of your own place and take it? And every force of hell, force of witchcraft that will not allow you and your family to rest. This fire, this sword will destroy the agenda of hell. Power! In the name of Jesus. Okay. She, she has just been healed of hepatitis B. Wow. Yes, sir. She said, as those declarations were. Yes, my yes. Yes. Your test results are here. Yes. Wow. Lifted from her. Her hand has been heavy, like an anointing came upon her left hand, and she's totally free. Come over here. Every everything that is in your blood that is affecting your life, I declare they are cleaned out in the name of Jesus. Alright, let's go. Which ear you couldn't hear? 
Right. For how long? For some time now. It has been difficult and painful. For some time, like up to how many years? Like barely a year ago. A year. All right. Can you close this one now? What of you? From primary school. I can't hear with my left ear. From when? Primary. From primary, you couldn't hear with this. Now close this. What of you? About seven years. Now. About seven years. Now, which one? The right. Okay, close the left one. What? Since childhood, you, were, you grew up to know that you couldn't hear with which one? This one. This one. So close this one. What have you? Huh? After senior high. After senior high, you couldn't hear with this. What have you? For 15 years. For 15 can years, you can't hear from this ear. Close this one. What have you? From childhood. From childhood, this was closed. Yes. Wow. One line. What have you? From childhood. From childhood, which yeah. ear you couldn't hear? My right ear. Incredible. And you close the, the left ear now, so you can begin to hear with this. What have you? I realized that since 2007, after SS. Since 2007, after SS, you couldn't hear with the left, the left ear. Close the right ear. Uh, yeah. What have you? About a year ago. About a year ago. With the left ear. Close the, the, le the right now. For four years now, you couldn't hear with this ear. Yes. Close this ear. With this ear. Okay, yes. close this one. What have you? For four months. For four now. months, you couldn't hear with, which, with, with this right one. Hand. What have you? Almost a year. Something like Almost that. a year. Okay, close this one. What have you? Since childhood, which one? Both ears. And you are hearing me clearly right now. What of you? Since childhood. Since childhood, which one? Yeah. This one. Close this one. What of you? More than five years. I sat beside a big speaker. And you and sat have... beside a big speaker and it, it, it deafened the ear. Since five years. Close this one now. More than five years. What of you? It's been a while. I can't remember. You can't remember? It's been a while. Time. All right. Which ear? This one. This one. Close the other one. Two years ago. Two years ago. Yes. Which ear? The left All right, close the right. What of you? Almost seven years now. Almost seven years now. Which one? The right one. You are hearing re me right clearly. What of you? It's my primary days. Since your primary days, you couldn't hear with this. Oh, yeah. All right, close this. What of you? From childhood. Childhood. Which one? Two years. And you are hearing me now. Are you just see, looking like that? What of you? 2020. From 2020. Which one? This one. This one. Close the other ear now. What of you? Oh my God, oh my, the line is almost endless. This is over 26 now. It's almost endless. Since JHS. Since JHS. And now, which, which one? All right, close it. What of you? For 23 years now, both ears, but I was asked to be operated on the left For ear. For 23 because years, in. because both ears. Now, all right, hold, hold on. All right, so we'll stop here for now, and then we'll continue. And, and then this was. For 23 years. Both ears. Now, yes. so speak after me. Say, Jesus. Jesus. Thank you. Thank you. I can hear. I can hear. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Say what I say. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I can hear. I can hear. Thank you, Lord. Say, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I can hear. I can hear. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, for, healing me. Thank you for healing me. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for healing me, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I am free. I am free. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I am free. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I am healed. Thank you, Jesus. I am I'm healed. healed. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for healing me. Thank you for healing me. I am free. I am safe. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I am free. I am free. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I am free. I am free. That is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27. Death in both ears or death in one ear. Some from childhood. Do you know the meaning of that to you? Everything that has followed you from childhood. Every affliction that has followed you from childhood. Everything my Father in heaven has not planted in your life that followed you from childhood. They are retrieved and they are sent back to hell. <laughs>now we have like 25 people 25 people there are still 25 people apart from these people sir that is over 50 something over people. 50 something people <laughs> one year what of you since childhood since childhood what of you from 2008 what of you since childhood my left ear for how long since, since childhood what of you my left ear so almost seven years almost now. seven years now what of you my right ear for about Years now. Over 10 years. What of you? Two weeks now. Secondary school. Two weeks. Two weeks now. What of you? Last year. 
Since last year, what of you? 2015, what of you? Six years now. Since last year. Started this year. 2015, seven years. Since last year. About one year now. About 39 years ago. About 39 years. My God, which one? Oh my God. How many of you are 39 years old? <laughs> wow. Give the Lord the praise. As followed. 40 years. Oh. 10 years. Oh, he also has a 2016, 2019. Both healed. Give the Lord a big clap of hand. And the Lord healed the other part of his life in Jesus' name. What of you? Two months ago. Two months ago, healed. Six years ago. Six years ago. 43 years now. 43. 43 years. Which one? This one. Close this one. This one that is here. Uh, close. Thank you. Thank you. 43 years. Sometimes, sometimes he can hear, sometimes he cannot hear. All right, Father, thank you for this child. What of you, ma'am? Since age 10. Since age 10, which year? My left year. Your left year, come up here. And Father, in the name of Jesus, thank you because it's done. Can you close this one? Yeah. Say Jesus. Jesus. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. I am healed. 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 And the power of God is upon you. Power! Now move your leg up. Move it. One. Just do what I'm doing. One. Do what I'm doing. One. Two. Faster. So, faster. So faster. Wonders, faster. Jesus the do. So so wonders. Jesus the do. So so wonders. Jesus the do. So so wonders. Jesus the do. Are you so, just so sitting? Jesus healed on the ear. So, so healed of the ear. Healed of the ear. So, so on. My, yeah, 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 yeah. Jesus, the duo. So, so on. Hey, so, so on. Jesus, the duo. So, so on. Come and see you. Come and see Hey, come and see you. She's still checking the leg. That's right. You saw her when she came. She asked me to bring her here. I don't know what was the problem, but she told me one of her ears is not working. Right now, she's working. I'm grateful to God. Give the Lord a big clap of hand. Give the Lord a big clap of hand. All of you here, you are going to celebrate your way back to your seat. Every other door closed in your life. This is over 50 something people. Every, whichever way they can. Every other door closed in your life. I declare them open right now. It's a new day. Is there someone with a cane like this? Anywhere you are right in the crowd, you have something like this. You lift it up. If you came with something like this and just lift it up like that. Father, thank you. Anyone like that? Where, wherever you are, right in the crowd or on the other. Yes, lift it high up. Wave it like that. Yes, I see it at the back. All right, in the name of Jesus, move your leg up and down. In the name of Jesus, pain is gone. Paralysis is gone. Move it up. One, two. One, two, one, two. So walk forward with it lifted. Walk forward with it lifted. He has sent for me. Walk forward with it lifted. Walk forward with it. That's right. Walk forward with it. Are you just looking like that, people? Celebrate the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. What my father cannot do, and what my mother cannot do. Yeah, he has sent for me. Oh. He has sent for me. Oh. He has done for me. What my papa can do, and what my mother do, and what my mother can do.
God. You gave the word that God was healing people that came with canes and walking stick. This man slipped in the front of his house and fell down and broke his leg. Since then, he couldn't walk with the stick. Since September, as you made the walk, get the word right now, the power of God surged through that leg. He lifted up the, 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 the walking stick and began to walk forward. God just healed How him. How did you walk when you came with him? That was how you walk when you came. Show the devil how you can walk now. I serve a God who is powerful. I serve a God who is powerful. This God is a good God. I will follow him to the I serve a God who is powerful. not yet healed please let them hold on those who are healed who can walk without the crutch those are the ones you bring forth for now we have not prayed for the sick yet so please ensure that those who are healed already give the lord a big clap and a shout of praise celebration celebration oh, oh, let me help you oh, do, do, do. wait let me help you O degu degu, o manchala. O degu degu, o manchala. Degu 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 degu. Call it cinema. Call it cinema. Call it call it cinema. Pastor, tell me what's happening. Tell me what's happening, Pastor. Somebody give the Lord a praise. Miracles everywhere. Another miracle just happened here now. Our sister had a condition with her spine and couldn't walk without the cane. Bring the cane, bring the cane. She couldn't walk without it. She told me that her shoulder was also locked. Sir, you gave the word that God was healing people with locked shoulder. She is one of the first beneficiary. The shoulder became the shoulder loose. became unlocked. It became unlocked, and then she started walking without a cane. How did she you walk here when you God came? has touched her. How are you walking with this? Right, so, like, I use this as a support because. Sometimes I do shiver. But when you declared somebody's shoulder, I just left it up and I said, Jesus, I'm expecting my miracle today. Now I can move it front and back. Now move your I back now. I'm healed. Move Daddy. your back. Somebody give the Lord a praise. Hola, 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 hola. Give the king the shout 
all the Holy Ghost. Your freedom is confirmed. In Jesus' precious name. Somebody lift your hands and say, Father, Father tonight is my night. Tonight is my, night. Tonight is my deliverance. Tonight is my, deliverance. Tonight is my freedom. Tonight is my Shout the Lord and say, Amen. Yes, what happened? This is a miracle. As helpless as she looks, she was brought in here more like on a stretcher, carried by several people. Carried by several people. Yes, sir. She suddenly complained of headache and then she became paralyzed. From the waist down, she couldn't move herself. She almost like she doesn't see what she she wasn't seeing well. But as the power of God hit her, she stood up by herself. She walked from wherever they were sitting all the way here to see. Come. Hey. Oh, 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 of Jesus in the name of Jesus yes tell us what more chains more chains breaking more chains breaking she said what happened <laughs> celebration tell me what happened <laughs> she more chains breaking she saw as you are declaring she saw two cages locked immediately the power of God hit those cages both cages were open. She's been going through emotional trauma, all manner of things. Two cages open at the same time. I announce and prophesy to somebody here. Every prison where the devil has kept you, every cage where the devil has kept you and your family, I declare it is open. It is open. Somebody shout power. Sir? This is a supernatural encounter. Jeremiah came all the way from Kumase. While you were ministering, God opened his eyes. He saw Rehan Bonki. He saw Catherine Coleman behind you on the altar. And as you were ministering, he saw a fireball and fire raining on everybody here. Then suddenly you became a light. And you were moving around everybody and you touched him. And he began to vibrate. His life is never the same wow. again. Wow! The way you, you choir people are behaving, if you are not careful, I will import all of you to Nigeria to come and sing like this. <laughs> How come you are singing all our songs? I'll just import all of you. Lift up your hands. Father, let the fire fall. Fresh grace. Stand up for your feet. Stand, stand, stand and hold your hands together. Stand up, all of you, stand up. Yes, and hold your hands together. Fresh fire. No, line by line, line by line. Line by line, lift your hands up. Lift it high up now. Push out behind them. 
fresh fire, fresh oil be released upon you. One, two, three. Power! My sheep are taken for Gayadana. Receive the freshness of fire, the freshness of oil, the freshness of grace be released upon you. I remember the first time I met this pastor. He was in our minister's conference. I had never met him. And what did I say to you when I, I came close to you? Sir, you said you see fire upon my life and you see me doing crusades in the north. Up where? North of Ghana. And then when you ministered to me, two days later, a man called from America and the man said, the Lord has spoken to him to give me tract of land in the north so that took me to the north to go and inspect the land when I got to the north in Bali then in about two months we put together a crusade and when we had the crusade thousands of people now, now, but first of all I, I, what did I tell you as, as, as per where you are from you said I'm from Ghana you just picked me from the crowd it was an all night and there were 100,000 people in the auditorium. And you walked up to me, and you, picked, you called me, and you said, I'm from Ghana. And I said, yes, I'm from Ghana. And you said, you see the Lord using me in Northern Crusades. Hey! hey! I want to announce to you today, God is about to give you a change of story. A change of story. A change of story. A change of story. Father, I use him as a point of contact again for every pastor and minister here. Fresh, Pastor Elvis, get ready. Something is coming on you on fresh night. Something great is happening. Sir, cancer just went back to hell. Just cancer. Cancer, colon cancer. Colon cancer. That started last year. Was operated upon. It didn't. And then it resurfaced again. She came here with terrible pains. Couldn't stand on her feet at all. As you gave the word, cancer went back to her. Hey. She could stand, do what she couldn't do before. Now she's totally The free. pain and everything is gone. The pain gone. The report, the, the report is here. Colon cancer. Are you with her? Yes, I interviewed her. You interviewed her. And now you are going, which hospital was this? Tell my general hospital. You are going to return back there and they will tell you that the cancer is gone forever. Come over here. Every life threatening situation in your life, every demon of death, I stand here against the demon of death. Your tenure expires. Fresh grace. Pastor, his pastor, Elvis, and his wife came up when you are saying, Pastor, take notes. Yes. Two mantles will come on you today. Jesus. This is the first. I got favor today. There will be a heavy downfall. A fresh fire today. A heavy downfall. Me to
first one. Get set for the next after the pro Papa, program. This is Abigail. And she's been having spandulosis. She couldn't stand still. She couldn't turn the neck. But as she made the declaration, she felt the power of God visiting her. And now she could stand well, run, move, and turn the neck. And, you, and, you, and you used this on your neck yes. before. Show us yes. how it was before. Yes. She was wearing this as, this as an aid. So just show she us how you, wore it, she... how you wore it before. A lady with a name that starts with an A, like an Abigail like this, with a breast condition, God is healing you right now. That Jesus. lump, whatever it is that you are afraid of, Jesus. that you are afraid that may look like cancer, whatever it is, is caused to its roots. Name starts with an A, with a breast condition. Can you check yourself, come off quickly, and God will heal you right now. Father, thank you, because of that person, with that breast condition, He, yes, let her come forward. He, right to the altar here. And you are he, All right, remove it now. He, Another one with a name that starts with an M, M. Like a Miriam or something with also a breast condition. The Lord is healing you right now as well. Check it right now. And run to the front here. Father, thank you. We give you the praise. We give you the honor. We give you the adoration. Blessed be your name. And you Power are of the Holy Ghost. And you are he. And you are he. Augustine, a breast condition. For how long? Augustine, a breast condition, sir. Step forward here. You feel the pain and the lump right now? Lift your hands. Lift your hands. Someone stand. Touch us. Dry up and die now in the name. Dry up and disappear. This is the Abigail you talked about now. That's her name. Breast or sharp prophetic words, sir. Breast lump on the left breast. She told me she has been afraid. She knew that the power of God will touch her today. As you made the declaration, she started looking for it. The breast lump has gone. The pain has also gone. Are you just looking like that, Ghana? There is, he said, there is a, 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 a lady with an A name like an Abigail like this yes, that has a breast condition, and that is exactly the Abigail. This is another exact Abigail. Another exact Abigail. Both breasts in her case. Lumps in the breast with pains. They just disappeared now. Are you just looking like that, Ghana? Are you just looking like that? Clap your hands, all ye people. Shout to the Lord. Dry up and disappear and return back no more. Listen, lift your hands and say after me, say in the name of Jesus. Everyone say after me, say in the name of Jesus. Every mountain in my life now, today is your expiry date. Oh, you mountain, you are living now. In the name of Jesus, on your marks, get set, shall go. Sir, this prophetic world is affecting several people. Three already, three already gone. Yes, With the sir. breast afflictions gone yes, here. Yes, sir. She has been looking for the lumps on the breast. It has been there for the past three years. What's her she name? She couldn't find it again. Your own is the one with the M. Wow. This is your result. She's crying. She's crying. She's been looking for the growth. She cannot find it. She can't find it, sir. Yes, that's mercy. She cannot find the growth. Somebody lift your hands and see after me say, every mountain, every mountain in, my life, in my life, today is your today end. Is your oh, you mountain, oh, you, mountain. You, are you are going now. On your mark, get set, shall go. Go! She also has a name with an A. Breast lump on the right breast. She can't find it again. It has gone back to hell. Eh? And now you can't find it. Step forward here. Father, in the name of Jesus, lift your hands. In the name of Jesus, every trace of death. 
in the name of Jesus. Her name is Akoswasa. Press lump has also disappeared. Another alien for how long? For, yeah, step forward here. For in the name of Jesus. Power of the Holy Ghost. Come and see the Lord is good. Come and see the Lord is good. There is nothing he cannot do. Come and see the Lord. Nothing, 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 nothing. There, there is, is nothing it cannot can do. Come and see the Lord is good. Everybody, come and see. Come and see the Lord is good. Everybody, body, 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 come and see. Come and see the Lord Everybody, is good. body, 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 body. There, there is, is nothing it cannot can do. Come, come and see the Lord is good. What happened here? Her name is Afelsa. Another name that starts with A. Lump on the breast has also gone back to her. Incredible. Stand over here. Incredible. Incredible. Yes. Another lump gone back to her. Her name starts with an M. The blood lump on the breast has been there for one year. Wow. Step forward here. Lift up your two hands. Father, thank you because it's over. Power of the Holy Ghost. You are free. Yes. Breast conditions that God has handled. All gone. Your, your name? Maria. That's Maria. Step forward here. And then. All right. Step forward here. All conditions of. It's gone. Lift your hands. Father. In Jesus' name. Now, if you have any condition around your body and you are trusting the Lord for the healing of them, place your hand and say after me, say, Father, I receive, I receive the touch of your power. Thank you, Lord. All these are amazing testimonies. They've been taken, some have been taken, but they are all totally free. Any testimonies? If we are to take all the testimonies tonight, we'll not be able to even round up here tonight. Your testimonies are permanent. That girl has been under the power of God since when you are In the name of Jesus, you are free completely. I heal completely, eyesight cleared. What happened? She has stroke. All right, lift up your hand, man. Thank you, Father, for this healing of this stroke. And for everyone here today, you are healed. Your healings are permanent in Jesus' precious name. Mind return back to normal in Jesus' precious name. Can we dance our way back to our seat right now for one minute? Celebrations. All of you right there, your testimonies are also permanent in Jesus' name. Let's dance our way back to our seat. You are the mighty, 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 mighty God, the great I am. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You are the mighty, 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 mighty God, the great I am. You are the mighty, 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 mighty God of great I am. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You are, you are the mighty, 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 mighty God of great I am. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You are the mighty, 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 mighty God of great I am. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You are, you are the mighty, 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 mighty God of great I am. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. You are the mighty, 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 mighty of great I am. Hallelujah, hallelujah. You are the mighty, 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 mighty God of great I am. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Somebody give the Lord a shout of praise. Father, thank you for this moment. In Jesus' name. Please be seated in the presence of the Lord. What a mighty God. Next time when we come. Next time when we come. <laughs> It will be a full-fledged crusade, not just one night. 
Are you excited to hear that? Shout the Lord and say amen. Give the Lord a praise. Take your seat. John chapter 5 verse 35. I'm going to be preaching very, very sharply. John chapter 5 verse 35. and a shining light and you were willing to rejoice in his light for a season John 5 35 he was a burning and a shining lamp and you were willing for a time to rejoice in his light I am speaking on burning and shining light which is the same as light and fire we want to understand the impact of existence with light and fire. John the Baptist was a man in the Old Testament. He was a phenomenon who existed with fire and light. John was a phenomenon. And there are three things I wanted you to know about John the Baptist. First of all, John existed as a voice, not a person. In John chapter 1 verse 23, he said, I am the voice of one crying in the wilderness. He existed as a voice. He was a statement. He was a revelation. He was not just a person. There are many people seated here tonight. God wants to make you a statement. He wants to use you to make a statement. He wants to use you to make a statement in your family, a statement in your community, a statement in your region, a statement in Ghana. And if you believe you are that one, you shout the loud and say, Amen. He existed as a voice. Number two, he commanded influence and compelled the attention of his generation. He commanded influence, he compelled the attention. Of his generation. John was the person that dragged the people into the wilderness. In Matthew chapter 3 verse 4 all the way to verse 6. When John ministered, not just individuals came, cities came. He commanded influence. He compelled his generation's attention. Beloved, you can exist in such a way that no devil can claim ignorance of your existence. No power from hell can claim they don't know you are there. No power in your community can claim they don't know you are there. A, an influence commander. An influence, a followership commander. That was John the Baptist. Thirdly, John broke barriers. Upturned traditions. And took territories. He broke barriers. He upturned traditions. He took territories. The traditional thing was for people to go to the church, to the synagogue, or to the temple. But no, John pulled them. He broke that tradition. He broke it. He worshipped in the synagogue. He worshipped in the, I mean, he worshipped in the wilderness. He, everywhere possible was a worship place for John. Soldiers were among those that submitted and bowed to his authority. There are people here tonight. I am anointed to announce to you. Very soon, you are about to break some barriers. You are about to break some barriers. You are about to break some traditions in your community. You are about to break tradition in your family. You are about to break traditions in your neighborhood. What people have never done before, Elvis, God is about to use you. What people have never done before, servants of the living God, God is about to use you to do it in Ghana, to do it in your family, to do it in your community. If you believe that, shout the loudest, amen. Look at somebody by side, tell them I'm about to break some barriers. I'm about to break some barriers. I'm about to upturn some traditions. I'm about to take territories because I am a burning and a shining light in my generation. You believe you shall the Lord say amen. Take your seat. Whatever you do, make sure you exist quietly. Whatever you do, don't exist quietly. Exist not noisefully but impactfully. Exist newsworthily. 
exists impactfully, exists as a territory taker, exists as a territorial commander, as an influence broker, exists as a barrier breaker, exists as a tradition breaker. That is why I came here tonight. Because there are a set of unusual people that God is raising in this generation. And I see some of them here right now. A John the Baptist generation. Unusual people. Abnormal people in the eyes of the world. People that will discipline the devil and humiliate the forces of darkness and humble witches and humiliate occultists. Somebody shout power! Take your seat in the presence of the Lord. What does it take to exist as a bunny and a shining light? Number one, spiritual intensity. Somebody say spiritual intensity. Or you can call it intense spirituality. That is when anyone comes close to you, they can feel the heat. When they come near you, they can feel your prayer life. When they come near you, they can feel the worship. When they come near you, they can feel your fasting. When they come close to you, they can feel your fire. Intense. Spiritual intensity. Anyone here like that, shout, I am here, Lord. Spiritual intensity number two. Tireless enthusiasm. You are the one to tire out the devil. Tireless enthusiasm. No tiredness, no weariness, no faithfulness. I preached last night, I preached this morning, I have preached this evening here. I was preaching another, this evening at the Accra International Conference Center, just now in the next one hour. And then I have another all night. Where's the venue? UPSA, yes, we'll be there tonight. And the journey continues, I'll be back to Abuja tomorrow. And then deal with devils on Sunday morning. <laughs> hey! 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 Somebody shout power! Say, I refuse to be tired out. I refuse to be wearied out. I refuse to faint. I am the one to tire out the devil. Take your seat in the presence of the Lord. You know, when you exist in the way I'm talking like, you are like the sun that rises every day for millions of years without tiredness. Or millenniums without tiredness. Burning forever without burning out. You know you have some light bulbs that burn out. No, no, not the sun. It burns without burning out. It rises without tiring. And it shines without blinking. That is the generation God is raising. And I see some of them are, are, around here. And if you are among them, you shout the loudest, amen. If you are among them, you shout the loudest, amen. Lift your hands and say, I have spiritual intensity. I have tireless enthusiasm say when you come around me you must be encouraged intensity number two tireless enthusiasm that first one in Romans chapter 12 verse 11 not slothful in business fervent in spirit serving the Lord and then Galatians 6 9 be not weary in well doing. In due season you shall reap. So we have spiritual intensity number two, tireless enthusiasm number three, spiritual violence. You need a high level of violence in the spirit. From the days of John the Baptist we are talking about until now, the kingdom suffered violence and the violence taken it by force. You need, you need to, you need in the realm of the spirit, 
you need to move about like mobile danger. Danger in motion. You need a high dangerosity index. <laughs> Help! Help! You know what happened? One young man in our church, he went to the village to build a house, dig boreholes, and do many things. And then there was a wizard in that community. You heard the story. A wizard in that community. Anytime you build a house or you do anything, he will look for you, shake hands with you. You are dead. So this young man did all these things, went to the village and commissioned it. Before that time, I met him in a, in, somewhere. I hugged him, embraced him. So, he went to the village and that old man was looking for him to come and shake hands with him. His father said, you better run to, back to Abuja. His mother already started crying because there was nobody the man shook hands with that did not die. So this young man, when he heard that the man was coming, he told the mother, he told the father, he said, you don't know where I'm coming from. So he went and wore the dress that I hugged him in. So he said, he wants to see the man. So the man came. The man wanted to shake him. He said, no, sir, I want to hug you. <laughs> hey! That was how the wizard hugged Transformer. <laughs> Our transformers very dangerous in Ghana. <laughs> the wizard went home that afternoon. He gathered his family together. I said, I have made a mistake. <laughs> they said, What happened? He said, I just made a terrible mistake. I just made a terrible mistake. That wizard slept overnight. The next day, he reported straight by direct entry to hell. Do they write a trust examination to universities here in Ghana? In Nigeria, they write, and there are some who don't write. That wizard report because he went and hugged Transformer. Not everybody is killable. Hey! Not everybody is killable by witches. Not everybody is wasteable by wizards. Not everybody is destroyable. I am here to announce to you, you are not a wasteable material. You are not a killable material. You are not a disposable material. Every witch and wizard looking for you shall be buried shortly. Look at your neighbor, say, look at your neighbor, tell them, say, if they are looking for me, tell them, if they want to hug Transformer, they can come. Give the Lord a shout of praise as you take your seat. You need to be intentionally dangerous in the spirit. You need to be deliberately dangerous. John. And so, we need spiritual intensity. Tireless enthusiasm, spiritual violence, number four is vision clarity. You need to know exactly who you are. If you are going to exist as an influence like John the Baptist, you need to know exactly who you are. You need to know why you are. You are not just existing at random. You are not just living life to chance. You are living deliberately and living intentionally. Said, I am the voice. I am the voice. I'm not just a person. I am the voice. I know who I am. I am the voice. I am a revelation. I am a statement. I am here. I am a message in my generation. I am, I am not just existing. Vision clarity. Number four, five is revelation intensity. 
you need the revelation of the word and be intense in the revelation of the word. The revelation of the word of God is the fuel for vision. I said that in the morning where I taught. With revelation, your vision can receive fuel. Many times, what you see from the word of God shows you what you are meant to see out of life. Revelation intensity. And finally, illumination existence. What do you need to do to be a burning and a shining light? You need illumination existence. Existence as an illumination. Living your life as an illumination to your generation. This is what I mean. You are conscious that you are not just living to yourself. You are living with a generation in mind. You take steps with your generation in mind. And I say to people at our round of here. Every one of us, you should live your life to a point where at least one person is taking steps after you. At least one person is following your example. At least one person is taking steps after you. One person. At least one person should be able to say, I like how you live. I want to pray like you do. I want to serve God like you do. Your life challenges me. You, you, every time I look at you, you push me to God. You push me to prayer. You push me to character living and integrity. At least one human being. That is what it means to me. Be fruitful, multiply, replenish the earth. Fill the earth with your type. Fill the earth with your type. Listen. If nobody is learning from you, if nobody is asking you questions, if nobody is drawing any lesson from your life, if nobody wants to be like you, in all probability, your life is being wasted. In all likelihood, you are not living the life you are meant to live. If nobody wants to be like you, nobody wants to follow your example, nobody wants to take steps after you, in all likelihood, that is the definition of a wasted life. Begin to exist as an illumination. And I see a change of story. Anybody ready to move as a burning and a shining light? Stand up on your feet. Lift up your two hands and just begin to give him the praise. Give him the honor. Give him the adoration. Give him the worship. Let us say frete so kaparata kakashakata kakalala. Give him the praise. Give him the worship. Give him the honor. Give him the adoration. Father, we praise you. Father, we honor you. Father, we adore you. Blessed be your name. Honor to your name. Adoration to your name. Worship to your name. Thank you, Master. In the name of Jesus. Lift up your two hands. I am going to pray and ask that the fire of the Holy Ghost will engulf everyone here tonight. Engulf every affliction, engulf every pain, engulf every disease, engulf everything that my father has not planted in your life. Lift your hands high. While we are doing that, in this vast audience, you are saying, Pastor, I want to make my ways right with Jesus. I want my sins forgiven. I want today to make a new day in my life. I want Jesus to be Lord over my life. I want my sins forgiven. I, I know God is not happy with me the way I'm living. I want my sins forgiven. Wherever you are, place your hand on your chest and pray this prayer with me. Say after me, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Louder. Lord Jesus, I am a sinner. In, I need your help. Jesus, come into my life. Make me a new person. Today, I have decided to follow you, Lord. No turning back. From today, 
I have decided to go forward ever. Backward never. The grace to live for you. I receive it now. Thank you Lord. For helping me. Be glorified. In Jesus precious name. Amen. All those who pray that prayer. And you meant it from your heart. Even though this place in the front is small. But you want me to pray for you. To live the life of a child of God. A life dedicated to God. Quickly within the next five minutes. Rush to the front. Carry your Bibles and bags. I'll give you the count of ten. Let me make it twenty. Because of those who will come from the roadside. And I will want you to be the first person to come forward. Don't be the last. Now let's go. One. Two, rush forward. Don't be the last to come, be the first. Two. Run, run, run. Three. It's a crowd of people coming. Four. As you come, come with your Bibles and your bag. That's right. From the roadside, come. Five. Six. Everybody stand up on your feet now. Keep coming, keep coming. Pastor Elvis and his wife, step, come up again. Keep coming. Something is happening here. Father, thank you for all these souls. If you have an addiction, you want broken, negative lifestyle, sinful addiction, masturbation addiction, Smoking, drinking, marijuana, gambling, fraud, whatever it is. You want it broken? Also step forward here and let us. Father, thank you. Those of you in the front, say after me again. Say, Jesus, I receive the grace to live for you. I receive help to do your will. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. And thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name, amen. I pray for you right now, every one of you. I have that the hold of sin be broken of your life. The grace to live for God be released upon you. A new day is upon you. In Jesus' precious name, say a louder amen. amen. Say a louder amen. amen. Say the loud most amen. amen. pastor and his people will organize how you can be counseled and I need to pray on these names a new season. How many of you believe light has come? You believe that there is light and fire in your life in Ghana. Can you pick up your phone if you have it and turn on your phone light and just lift it up. That's right. 
Wave it. That's right. Say in my life, light has come. In my family, light has come. In Accra, light has come. In Ghana, light has come. And the glory of the Lord is risen. In Accra, in Ghana, the glory of the Lord is risen. Now, wave it, wave it, wave it, wave it, wave it, wave it. Man, I, 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 I. I prophesy a new season of light, a new season of fire, a new season of glory, a new season of harvest, a new season of manifestation, a new season of the supernatural. I prophesy now. Help her. Lift your hands high now. Father, that's the hospital. Yes, wave your light in the hospital as well. Everywhere, everywhere, everywhere. Light has come. And the glory of the Lord. I see light in all those buildings. Everywhere, the story buildings up there, the pharmaceuticals. Everywhere, all around. I see light, 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 light. Light in the darkness. Light in the darkness. Light in the darkness. Light in the darkness. Light has come. The glory is risen. Over Ghana, light has come. Light has come. Light has come. Light has come. Even in Nigeria, light has come. Ivory Coast, light has come. Benin Republic, Togo, light has come. Côte d'Ivoire, la Côte d'Ivoire, light has come. Wave it, wave it. Let's tie up. Freshness. Again, another season. Season of light, season of speed, season of increase. <laughs> Lift your hands high. When I say in the name of Jesus, one, two, three, you scream fire at the top of your voice. And as you scream that fire, you place your hand on your head and begin to pray in the spirit. If there is a cancer, if there is a curse, if there is a spirit of death, if there is a, a, an anti-marital spirit, if there is a barrenness devil, a spirit of rejection, if there is any limitation on your life, the garment of poverty, empty-handedness, wretchedness, they shall be set on fire. Lift your hands high. Father, let the fire flow. Let the fire burn. 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 When I say in the name of Jesus, one, two, three, you scream fire at the top of your voice and place the hand on yourself. Father, let the fire burn. Let the fire burn. In the name of Jesus, one, two, and three, fire. Place your hand on your head and pray in the spirit. Fire. Fire. Pray, fire, 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 la ya 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 and pray and declare the fire has come 
Our lives will never be the same. 